Good morning, friends. We are just getting started our school day. We're only gonna do a pretty, very, actually very condensed school morning because we are going out to my sister's house for a couple of the boys to get haircuts. It has been a long time since we got haircuts. I don't even remember what it was. It was probably like November sometime. I don't know. It's been a long time. And so we'll just do a little bit of school this morning, go out, come back and do a bit of school this afternoon. But welcome to today's vlog. These boys, <laughs> they're so into playing with cars lately. I was just gonna say this broom, I feel like is out all the time right now because there's constantly toys, especially cars, right? Yeah. Going under the couch. Going through our Bible curriculum here, I, I get asked questions on where I you know, found all this stuff for our Bible curriculum. I do have a video from the beginning of the year where I did share our Bible curriculum, so maybe I'll link that down below, all in one spot, so that if you guys are wondering about our Bible curriculum, you can check it out there. But for now, we are going to recite these, the A to Z attributes of God. We have gotten so far to what? T, right? T is the last one that we've learned so far. Changing, I oh, we did truth action. and unchanging. You're yeah. right. We learned those last time. Okay, let's say these. God is Almighty, blessed, creator, deliverer, eternal, faithful, good, holy, infinite, just, kind, loving, merciful, never ending, omniscient, patient, quickener, righteous. Sovereign, truth, Very good. Let's say those all one more time. I have to show a little before of this long hair. Good? All right, let's see. Turn to the side. Turn, turn. Long, long hair. How short are you get, gonna get it cut? As little as possible. As little as possible. He likes his hair long, but it's just, it's a little bit much right now. Let's see the after. I love it. Elijah, every time you get your hair cut, I'm like, why didn't we do this earlier? <laughs> it looks so nice, clean and fresh. All right, are you up next? Yeah. Wesley's been complaining the last few days about what? What have you been complaining about your hair? That is in my eyes. It's in your eyes. Are you ready to get it out of your eyes? Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. that's exciting. Wesley, look at mommy, let's see the before. Look at that long hair. How short do you want your hair? Mm. What do you think? What do you want? Do you want it still long or do you want it short? Short. Let's see. What do you think? <laughs> you look so good. Okay, do a spin so I can see the back too. Do a spin. <gasps> okay, let's see the front again. I love it. Why are we so washed out? I do not know. What's happening? <laughs> we are now here for grocery pickup. We did, Elijah and, and Wesley, as you saw, got their haircuts. Simeon did not get his haircut. He got his haircut last time, same time as the other boys, but for whatever reason, his hair grows like half as fast. I was looking at it now thinking it probably could have used a little clean up, but we're here now waiting for groceries. We've been listening to a podcast. Um, the kids love listening to Smash Boom Best. If you have kids around my kids' ages, I'm sure you would love this wow. podcast. They are always comparing two things, um, debating, and they have lots of fun topics. So tell us Mommy. what two things they're debating today. Waffles and pancakes. Waffles and pancakes. I'm Guys, waffles. comment. Comment down below and let us know what you would choose, pancakes or waffles. Elijah, what's your vote? I don't know. Waffles. You don't know? Waffles. Indecisive? I'll, I'll, okay, I'll, sit no, down for a second. Would you like better? Sit down for a second. Pardon. I mean, I, I like waffles better, but yeah. I don't know who's a better debater, though. Like, right, right. Debates. Okay, my vote is for pancakes, and I think I'm outnumbered in this family. I much prefer pancakes. Wesley, what's your vote? Pancakes. Charity and Zara? Waffles. Waffles Me for too. both of you? Oh my goodness. You know what? what? There's going to be a new one of trampolines versus hammocks. I would definitely say trampolines. Trampolines versus hammocks. Yeah. That sounds like a really mm -hmm. fun one. I wasn't planning on bringing all the kids in the store. <laughs> we needed to come in and just get a couple more things, but everybody wanted to come. All right, guys, follow me. Come on, let's keep going. We're trained. <laughs> so 
Okay, in my grocery hauls, you guys have said, I want to see how milk is sold. Okay, here's how our milk is here. We have our cartons that have just like a liter or even the bigger ones have two liters of milk. And then we should get these, um, and then, these and muffins again. Yeah, we should sometime. And then in here, we have all of our bagged milk. So we have 2%, 1%, whole milk. That's how we buy milk here. What? 3.25, yeah, that's called whole milk. This day has just flown by. I got groceries put away. Um, I have stuff sitting there on the counter because I need to make chili for supper. But it's already like 2.30 and I've just been go, go, go. We went shopping, got home, put away groceries. I still have a couple kids here. Finishing up math, they're almost done. They'll go for a little quiet reading time because they've been kind of go, go, go today too. And so I should be starting chili because then we have to leave for swim lessons in another hour and a half. But I want to sit down. I'm going to sit down for a minute first. So I poured myself a coffee. I'm going to go put this down because I remembered something else. I'm, I'm catching up on like the questions you guys ask me. What was the other one I said earlier today? Oh, the Bible curriculum. I'm going to show you something else. I was noticing these pictures on the wall. We've got all these baby pictures on the wall. And in one of my recent vlogs, someone asked me, oh, would you show a closer up a closer up um, picture. Show us closer up those pictures on the wall. What we did is we took pictures of each of the kids when they were one, and that's what we have on the wall over here. So this one, who is that? It's Elijah. We got that one done at Walmart, I think. And then when Charity turned one, we had a really good camera and I was like, let's not go pay for a picture, let's do it ourselves. And I am actually pretty happy with how it turned out, but I kind of wish that I had um, just gone in and done it professionally <laughs> because just it's just not quite the same as the other kids' pictures. It's a little bit closer up, the angle's not quite the same. But there's Charity. And then with Simeon, we went back in to get it done professionally. He was my baby with the least hair. <laughs> and the chubbiest face. And then Zara, I remember hers really well because she would not smile. Like finally she has like that teeny tiny smile, but it was so hard to get a smile out of her for her pictures. Elijah and Wesley were my smiliest babies. So it was like no problem getting them to smile. And then Wesley's, I just love that look. Look at that cutie. So there it is, we have all of their one year pictures. Wesley was just showing me, look how long I am. Look how far you can reach. Your legs are hanging off one side, your hands hanging off the other. You're growing up too fast, dude. <laughs> what did you say when I said you're growing up too fast? I wish I could like replicate <laughs> these little conversations I have with him. He said, what? I'm a grown up? Yeah. <laughs> no, you're just growing up. So fast, right? You're still a kid. I said I'm, I'm grown up so fast. You're grown up so fast. Oh man. <laughs> Chili is now cooking. It might be a little bit um, of a thinner sauce than usual because I'm out of tomato paste. So I had to put tomato sauce in instead of tomato paste. Yes, I did groceries today, and yes, I try every time I finish up something to straight away write it on the grocery list, but somehow that got missed. So the chili is cooking though, it will be fine. I got a bunch of grapes washed for snack. Now I just have to get everything ready to go out the door for swim lessons. And I got changed into my workout outfit because I have been on a weekly basis going for a run on the treadmill at the gym while the kids are doing swim lessons. I've been doing this now since, I don't know, maybe October or November. I've been running every week and it's been so good. I've always said that I much prefer strength training to cardio and to running. Running has never been my favorite, but I am starting to enjoy it. Last week I ran 5K during the kids' swim lessons, which is the longest I've run so far. It's been really good. It's been good to challenge myself, and I'm still not up for like running outside. I like the treadmill because I can kind of keep track and push myself and see like, okay, I'm at 17 minutes. Let's just get to 18 minutes. I'm at, you know, two and a half kilometers. Let's just get to three kilometers and I can kind of just keep track as I'm running and I enjoy that. I guess I could do that on my watch too. But for now, I'm just a treadmill runner. 
but I've got to get the kids, make sure they all have swimsuits and stuff, and we're going to head out the door. Thank you for watching today's vlog. I hope that you enjoyed seeing a day in our life. I'll see you next time.